my geeky guys, guys, welcome back to Boogeyman 2. I'm your host, Mask Geek. We are on night three, and things are going to be kicking off. I hope it's usually about night three. So good, mommy. Thank Don't you. Worry. Just keep fighting. I will. Don't you worry, sweetums. Why oh, is he going to kind of come out of the bed like he did in uh, towards the end of Boogeyman One? Hoo <laughs> hoo, spooky. So it's still version 1.4. It's version 1.4.1. So, there's still no house room, but I also don't know at this stage yet as to whether there's going to be a creepy ghost girl like there was in the previous one. Hi, I saw that. You get me yourself, get, get, get me a bite. Get back in your closet. He's seen it. And he's opened the door. Great. It's because I just told him off, isn't it? That's the reason why. Fuck, he's quick. He just opened that door and creeped him to the vent that quick. Jeez, I must be thinking that he's like the xenomorph or something. Alright, oh, where's my battery indicator? Over there. My battery indicator's fine. Because I learned from Boogeyman when. I like this body. Thank you. It feels so close to my old one. Are you the ghost girl from Boogeyman 1? Wait, what's up there? Apart from... Boogie man, okay, that was cool. I threatened him off before even the sound effects. Oh, lightning. I threatened him off even before the sound effects. Oh, the um, great thing actually happened. Go oh, to fuck. Yeah, ball. So she a ghost girl from Boogie Man 1, and now she's. I saw your eyes there, you creepazoid fuck. You little pervy bastard. If you can beat him, maybe I'll tell you a secret, okay? Okay, cool. I'll hold you to that deal. Fucking hell, everything's dying. The fucking fish is pissed on the bat, um, light again. Just like I always wanted. Um, close it. Thank you. Get out of the way, fly. No time for you right now. Okay. Yeah, I see it. I see it, Boogie. So she the ghost girl from Boogie Man 1. I can't remember what her name was. Has she now possessed the doll? Everything are spoopers, right? Vent. I'm gonna wait for another attack. Well, at least for another creep on him. And then I'm gonna try, try and charge up. Are you always there on the bed? Yeah, creepy ass bam bam on the bed. I, I see you. Flashy. Right, charge, charge, charge it. Uh, that'll do. <laughs> I saw boo. I knew it. So you, you've got to be quick on the battery charge because you press the mouse, uh, right mouse button once to initiate the battery charge and then you press it again to get back into the game. But as you notice there, it took about a second to get back to the game. So on later nights, you've got to be really quick with that. If there's, I think there is a nightmare mode to this. I, I think there was a nightmare mode. Oh, fuck! That... That... That's not Game Boy music. Seriously, that's not Game Boy music. When I mean, it gets too dark, mommy, try to look for the glowing eyes. I, I just, wait, dude. I just, dude, you, you, you can't attack me from the same place twice. You're not lightning. Jeez. I mean, I ought to figure that out, little girl. I already knew about the eyes because you kind of did that towards the end of Boogie Man One. You see, the eyes have it. They have a freak in the dark. You're going to be peeping at you. So all you need to do, give a quick flash. Those freaky ass titties of mine. While you were sleeping, I found some of these. They think they might help. Found what? Oh, cool. Thank you. Well, what about the one up there, though? That doesn't help. So, oh, does that mean um, she's in control of those things? Or if it does, if Barry does update the game to get a house room element to it, do we pick them up so we can use them in a future update? I heard that. You can back off. So, oh, okay. Uh, light the Christmas tree lights have gone out. Mama heard the Game Boy going. She knew that we were up late at night, and so she's switching everything off by the fuse box, making sure we go to bed. Because we're coming close to Christmas, we got a Tattletail present, even though I've already finished that game. But I know we've got a Tattletail, 
It's a little Furby dude. That's what it is. I got me a little present. It's going to be better than you, you freaky ass doll. I prefer the Furby. I mean, okay, it's probably going to chat to me back later on once it learn learns what my English is like. Even though it's not the best English in the world. Charger, 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 dink! Ooh, you creepy creep. You quick creep. Yeah, so we're at half past five right now. We're doing good. Nice one to three, probably four. I should be able to get away without too much incident, but I wonder if in later nights he's going to creep up on the side of the bed like he did in Boogeyman 1. Go away. I ain't got no Girl Scout cookies for you this evening. Domino's ain't foamy, so, you know, I can't get anything. No side orders, no dish, no nothing. Yeah, but I don't tr really blame the uh, delivery guy for not delivering at, at this time in the morning, especially when it's raining like that. So, yeah, I don't really want him to come around and deli deliver soggy wet pizzas anyway. Now the pictures are changing. I wonder if you change. Interesting. Anyway, that's all for this one, my geeky guys and guys. We've got night three over and done with. Let's get back to the main menu, because I don't want it to creep on my ass while I'm doing the outro. Don't know why I said it like that, because I'm weird. After all this time that I've been on YouTube with 700 videos uploaded, maybe everyone should realise now that I'm just fucking crazy. I'm... Rid Doggy! What are you doing there? Oh, my God, it's Doggy! Oh! <laughs> hey, Doggy, I'm going to call you Rover. Actually, no. I, I can't call you Sparky because you died in Fallout 4. What can we call you? Oh, I need to think of a name for you. Oh, uh, what can we do? Um, um, Lurcher, Lurcher uh, Lurcher Luke. Yeah, Lurcher Luke. You're going to be, um, Large Lur, uh, Large Lur, uh. <laughs> That's a tongue twister. Large Lurker Luke. Try saying that when you're drunk. Anyway, <laughs> sleep forever. Night three, my geeky guys. Guys, we got night four coming up next. Let me just check. And yes, there's a nightmare night. Can't access it yet. I don't know if it is actually going to be in this version yet. Because I think, if I remember correctly from Boogeyman 1, we needed a key to get to nightmare night. And to get that key, we have needed to have completed all, I think, all six nights of the main game. Oh, squeeze on me. And the Halloween night, do the house roam and get to that little secret area where the boogeymen were dancing. So I don't know if there's going to need to do the same thing here again. Anyway, that's it. Yeah, we're all out of time for this one. Night three's over and done. We've next video is going to be night four. So thank you so much for watching this video, my geeky guys and guys. If you liked it, smack the like button. If you didn't, smack the dislike button. If you do dislike, though, please leave me a comment down below and let me know what I can do to improve the video just for you. And as always, if you want to know when the next video's coming out, smack the subscribe button down there. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon next to it to be part of the notification squad. And I'll see you in the next video. Shut up creeping. So bye bye for now. Come on, lads, Lurger Luke. Let's see what walk is. Come on, pip pip. Come on, let's go. Look at his happy little face, though. He's probably done his business on my bed. Dirty boy.